Please be advised that visiting hours are now over. Oh well, looks like we have to wait until tomorrow. No can do, Toots. Remember what she said? The deacon comes to her at night when she's sleeping. Waiting until tomorrow won't do us any good. What? You think we can just waltz right into Susan's room? Sure. How? Improvise, sweetheart. That's what this gig is all about. I don't think I need any of these other keys. Looks like a fuse box. Judging by the flickering lights, it must be broken. You need a key to open it. I don't think I Fuse box key? I could probably do something with this. I don't think I need... You need a key to open... You need a key. Looks like a f judging. You need a key. Well, so you best get in. So you best get in. So you best get in. Now you've done it. You better find a place to hide quick. Whoa, you startled me. You'd better leave, miss. I can't be held liable for your safety until the lights are repaired. I'll get the elevator for you. She's asleep. Yeah, like a baby. It won't be long. Before what? Before that. Please. Please. Can't you help me? Please. I don't know what to do. I don't want to burn. Please! The others are gone. You're the only one! Please! You can't hear me here, but you can hear me in your dreams. Please! Wake up and help me! Hey! Ignore them, Susan. Listen to me. Help me. Please! I'm talking to you, clown shoes. You're... You're talking to me? Yeah, so can you calm down long enough to tell me what's going on? I... I can't. You're like me. What do you mean? Dead! Like me! Wait a minute. Just a goddamn minute. You know you're dead? Yes! Well, that certainly saves time. We can help you. Here, grab a hold of this. No! no. Get that away, away from, from me. me! What the hell is wrong with you? You need saving. We're here to save you. What's the problem? I can't. What are you so scared of? You're stuck, right? We can help you move on. No. I don't, I don't want, want to. You don't want to? No, I... I'm afraid. Oh, you're afraid, are you? 
You believe this guy? What do you want? Safety. Sanctuary. It's following me. Waiting. Watching. Trying to take me. But it hasn't caught me yet. Not yet. Yeah, whatever. This guy's off his nut. Let me handle this baby doll. I know how to speak to spooks like this. What hasn't caught you? It. It. I see it everywhere. In every shadow. In every corner. Why is it after me? Why? The soft touch ain't gonna cut it, sweetheart. You're too green. Let me show you how it's done. Who is after you? It! It! Haven't you ever seen- Forget it, kid. He is- We're waste- He knows he's dead. We don't need kid gloves to handle it. Let me take over. Sure. Do it your way. All right, Mac. Spill. You've scared these girls literally to death, and I want to know why. What are you so afraid of? I... I don't want to burn! Burn? Oh, oh, I get it. You think you're going to hell. The devil himself. He told me. Please don't make me go. You're scared of the devil, huh? Yes! Yeah, well, I don't see any devil. There's just you and me. And you know what? I'm worse than any devil you'll ever see. Hey! I've been doing this for 40 years, bucko. Every ghost I meet goes to their final rest one way or the other. You're scared? I don't give a rat's ass. Two people are dead because of you. So take the damn tie and let's get this over with. No! You can't make me! Don't make me burn, please! <laughs> Hurts, don't it? How? Ghosts aren't supposed to feel pain, but I've learned some tricks. Now take the damn tie! Joey, stop it! You wanna handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. I know a safe place. You can hide there. Really? Where is it? Not far, but you'll have to trust us. Trust you? Why should I trust you? Because nobody else has offered to help you before, right? Yeah. You ask and ask for help, but nobody answers, right? No. Nobody answers. Well, we have. We're gonna help you. Has anybody else said the same? No. No, they haven't. I think... Oh, I'm so tired of running. If you say you can help me, I believe you. What needs to be done? Just listen to my friend. Here, just take the tie. You know what to do. I can't believe she pulled that off. Ow. You were right. I feel... safe. Are you ready? Yes. I really think so. It's really nice out here. Almost like... Like... At last, I have found you. No! You lied to me! What? It's, it's here. here! You lied! What's that? Oh, crap! Joey? Joey! Get me out of here! Stay away! Stay away! There is nowhere to go. You cannot return to the mortal world. You can only go through me. Accept the punishments for your sins and come with me. Help me, please! You brought me here! You have to save me! You have to! Fool, no one can save you now. I'll give you a moment to prepare for the eternity to come, but then you are mine. What is that thing? 
It's come to take me to hell! Just like it always said it would. That stone looks a little loose. What is that thing? What is that thing? I don't know. It haunted my dreams when I was alive and wouldn't leave me alone after death. And now there's no place left to run. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what's in it? Nothing. It's just a force of habit, I guess. Used to keep whiskey in it when I was alive. So what can I do? What does he want? He wants me. I don't know why. Uh, excuse me. Converse with me not. I shall give him time to prepare himself for the eternity to come. But then, he is mine. How did you get here? What is here? It is but an abstract concept to one such as I. I move at the power of thought, at the speed of death. Once my business is concluded, I shall trouble you no more. Why are you after this man? For his sins. All this time, he has not renounced them. Even after these many years of death, he still carries them with him. Can't you just let him go? He has killed many with his madness. His sins weigh him down even as we speak. Ask yourself, does he deserve mercy? Yes? You may think so, but your heart does not believe it. You have witnessed the results of his actions with your own eyes. Please, help! The deacon is carrying his sins, and the deacon is carrying his flask. Could this be symbolic? Get rid of that flask. Huh? Your flask! Get rid of it! My flask? Why? Just do it! But, but I can't. Why not? Because it, it's my flask. You want to be free of that demon? Trust me. Well, oh, okay. You no longer carry your sins with you, dead one. But they still taint this place. That is not enough to save you. It is done. The sins have been abolished from this place. And my claim on you, dead one, is gone. Move on in peace and be troubled no more. He's gone? I think so. He's gone. I'm, I'm free of him. I'm really free. All this time, it's all so clear to me now. Like my head was full of cobwebs and now they're gone. I... All those people who died... They killed themselves because of me. Yes. I didn't know what I was doing, but that doesn't excuse it. I spent most of my life as a drunk and most of my death as a murderer. I was worried about going to hell before. Maybe I'm okay with that now. Now that I know I might deserve it. You seem strangely happy about it. I'm just happy to know. You see, I was a religious man once. Before disease took my wife away, and I took to the bottle. 
If I'm going to hell, well then maybe I can still spread the word of God there. Do some good for once. Well, this is it. Goodbye, and thanks. Jesus Christ, kid, you all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. What took you so long? It got a little complicated. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. Let's get out of here. I need some air. I know the perfect place. I saved him, I think. Gave him some hope, at least. He's getting no more than he deserves. No more than any of us deserve. I guess. I really wished I could have popped him one more time. He really hacked me off. Is that your answer to everything? Don't you start judging me. You managed to pull it off. I'm impressed. I'm just... glad you're okay. Joey? Yeah? Why did Auntie stop? Stop what? Stop doing this. This ghost saving or whatever it is we do. Oh. Ah. Uh. It was you. Me? She wanted to take care of you. Wanted to do it right, she said. Stop listening to me. Stop saving the ghosts. Just put all her effort into taking care of you. And then she fell into that weird coma. Yeah. I see. I guess there's a lesson in that. Is there? Yeah.